the tail of the big toe. A boy was digging at the edge of the garden when he saw a big toe. He tried picking it up, but it was stuck to something. So he gave it a good hard jerk, and it come off in his hand. Then he heard something groan and scamper away. The boy took the toe into the kitchen and showed his mother. It looks nice and plump, she said. I'll put it in the soup, and we'll have it for supper. That night, his father carved the toe into three pieces, and they each had a piece. Then they did the dishes, and when it got dark, they went to bed. The boy fell asleep almost at once. But in the middle of the night, a sound awoke in him. It was something in the street. It was a voice. It was calling to him. Where is my toe? It groaned. When the boy heard that, he got very scared and thought, it doesn't know where I am. It'll never find me. Then he heard the voice once more, only now closer. Where is my toe? It groaned. The boy pulled the blanket up over his head and closed his eyes. I'll go to sleep, he thought. When I wake up, it'll be gone. But soon he heard the back door open. And again, he heard the voice. Where is my toe? It groaned. Then the boy heard footsteps move through the kitchen, into the dining room, into the living room, into the front hall. Then slowly, they climbed the stairs. Closer and closer they came. Soon they were up the stair hall and now were outside his door. Where is my toe? It groaned. His door opened. Shaken with fear, he listened as the footsteps slowly moved through the dark towards his bed. Then they stopped. Where is my toe? It groaned. You got it! <laughs> and that was the tale of the big toe. Good night.